Hi, I'm Ken Block, factory Subaru Rally driver, co-founder and chief brand officer of DC Shoes, and father and husband. Uh, I got started in business basically in sort of a in a fluky way. Uh, I was a snowboard bum for a while after high school, and afterwards came back and realized I've got to face some reality and figure out a business angle. A friend of mine introduced me to some courses he was taking in graphic arts, silk screening, um, logo development, that type of stuff. If they would have it, I actually ended up being very good at it. From there, I just started screening t-shirts for local shops, and the idea of actually owning my own brand came into play and came up with the name Apol. And right about that time is when I befriended Damon Way, who I sat down next to in an algebra class. He came in as a 50% partner with the business. And uh, it, from there, it just sort of blew up. And eventually, we started DC Shoes. Hey, all right, well, now we're at my office. This is where I spend oh, a lot of my life. Come on in. So we've been in these offices about 12 years. This is where I spend a lot of my life when I'm actually in town. I'm able to make it into work and basically be available for meetings, but a lot of time I sit just here with my laptop. I actually love this, this meeting desk. I had pads of paper made for it so that when we just come in and meet at this table that we can actually draw right on the table. We enjoy doing all the creative stuff, designing the apparel, doing all the logos, ads, hiring athletes. That was the stuff that Dame and I were really good at, but you know, the business back end stuff, dealing with the banks and inventory, man, we sucked at it. <laughs> but luckily, you know, we are able to hire some really good people and some of those people even today still work for us. So of course, I always have a random stock of monsters. You know, some days work, you know, your energy levels are low. <laughs> and actually, I think our employees drink it more than I do. When I see someone on the street or at a mall or at one of the races, wherever that they're actually wearing our products, uh, I'm stoked. I'm, I'm just stoked that people appreciate, you know, the logo and the brand and, and everything that we've built behind it, uh, that they see a value in that and want to wear it. So it's actually a very good feeling for me. And this particular piece was from the mega ramp that we had out, um, out in the desert and this was a part of that ramp. It's actually dated here from April 16, 2002. He, this is the sheet of panel where he actually landed at 65 feet, which was the world record for the distance at that time. That's a photo that actually shows all the plates in my hand, along with the plates in my wrist. Snowboarding dirt bikes. Oh, yet I almost forgot this. This wheel, it's one of those things that we really shouldn't be that proud of. That's actual the wheel on the car with Alex sticking out the back. And that was a, a few miles into the transit back to service after the stage. I hope it doesn't happen too many more times in my life. I look at like 10 car magazines a month, even before I was in rally, I just did that. Like I love car design that much that I just paid that much attention to the, the cars themselves and then the types of motorsports that were going on. This is one of our main meeting rooms, and that's, you know, can't let you see too much, but that's all of our uh, fall 2009 snowboard boots. So we've been working on the fall, you know, the winter 2009 line for already like six to eight months. You know, if DC never made it, I, I don't know what I'd be doing. Wherever you end up is based on your decisions and your hard work and everything it takes to get you there, and I'm very lucky and fortunate the path that I've been able to take to be sitting here today. This is one of the newer ones that uh, is all set up with cubicles for the whole design and development department for footwear. Uh, I truly uh, enjoy going out and doing a time attack or Gymkhana or being in the drift car. It's, it's very fun, but to me, uh, rally, is, it's, it's just what I do and it's what I love to do. You know, it's funny, I, I get asked this a lot, what is how far am I trying to go in rally? What are my future plans? I will honestly tell you that I don't know. <laughs> the level of driving that I'm doing and the level of notoriety I've gotten is just way beyond what I expected. So my goal really hasn't changed. My goal is to be the best driver that I can be. 